preparados para jugar en un camión de helados? Dale al play y diviértete con Alex y Lily. Hola, Lily. Hola, Kira. ¿Pero qué pasa? Si ya llegó el verano, deberíais estar alegres. Oh, ya os habéis terminado los zumos y tenéis calor. ¿Y por qué no os dais un chapuzón? ¡Claro! Kira le tiene miedo al agua del mar. ¿Qué os parece si hacemos unos helados en el camión de helados de Tuntun? <ríe> ¡Lo vamos a pasar genial! ¿Dónde estáis? <ríe> ¿Preparadas para aprender a hacer helado de arco iris? Es muy fácil, mirad. Para el color rojo usaremos sirope de fresa aguado. Un poquito de almíbar. Y por último, para que quede un color bien intenso, añadiremos dos gotas de colorante rojo. ¡Primer color listo! ¡Vamos con el naranja! Para el sabor usaremos zumo de naranja. Y un poco de almíbar. Una gota de colorante rojo. Y para conseguir un tono naranja bien fuerte, una gota de amarillo. Para el amarillo usaremos... ¡Eso es, Lily! Zumo de limón con agua. Un poco de almíbar. Y dos gotas de colorante. ¡Muy bien, Kira! ¡Amarillo! Para el azul usaremos zumo de limón. Un poco de almíbar. Y dos gotas de colorante azul. En cambio, para el color morado, volvemos a usar el sirope de fresa con agua. El almíbar. Dos gotas de colorante azul. ¿Y qué color se mezcla con el azul para conseguir el morado? ¡Muy bien! Dos gotas de colorante rojo. Ya hemos terminado con los colores, chicas. Así que insertamos un palo para poder agarrarlos. Y ya solo queda congelarlos. para Lily y otra para Kira. ¡Ya sabéis hacer helados de arco iris! ¡Hola, ¡Oh, Alex! ¡Hola, Lily! ¡Oh, wow! You two look like you're rather hot. We'd better get you some refreshing drinks. <laughs> I knew you'd like the idea. Hey, guys. What do you think Alex and Lily should drink to keep cool? Leave your ideas in the comments! Shall we? Let's go to the kitchen! Look, we've got everything we need to make homemade soft drinks! What flavour drink would you like? Orange! Great! What about you, Alex? Strawberry! Good choice! First, we have to blend your fruit of choice in the juicer. We add a few oranges for Lily. Look at the juice coming out! And now we add strawberries for Alex. This recipe is so healthy! <laughs> I think I'll also make one for myself. But mine will be... grape flavoured! Check out this cool purple colour! <laughs> now that we're done with the first step, we have to add some sugar. Some fruit like grapes, oranges or bananas already contain lots of sugar. But we do need to sweeten the strawberries though. <laughs> And thirdly, we have to add sparkling water. That's right! Fizzy drinks have loads of bubbles. Perfect! 
perfect. Mmm, these look amazing. <laughs> but you can't drink them yet. Mm. They're missing the most important thing. Mm. If we want them to be cool, we have to add ice. One ice cube for Alex, one for Lily, and another one for me. We are really going to enjoy this new recipe this summer. <laughs> All right, now you can try your drinks and see what you think. <laughs> Bottoms up. <laughs> Hi, Alex. Hi, Lily. <laughs> we haven't made any dessert in the kitchen lately. Do you fancy McFlurry ice cream? <laughs> and what toppings would you like? There are so many different possibilities. <laughs> hmm? Great, Alex. An Oreo cookie McFlurry for Alex and... <laughs> For you, Lily? <laughs> That's such a good idea! An M&M McFlurry for you! Yay! Hey guys, can you think of any other desserts we could make with Alex and Lily? You can tell us in the comments and we'll get right on it! <laughs> Go put on your chef outfit and I'll see you in the kitchen! Yay! Yay! Everything is ready! A McFlurry is a vanilla ice cream, so in order to make it, we need the bowl to be cool. Here it is, in the fridge! First, we have to make the ice cream, which will be the base of our dessert. Let's add the ingredients. First, we add the whipping cream. There, this will be enough. And now we have to beat it. We have to whisk it really fast so that it's really creamy. Mmm, it looks amazing! Now, in order to make it sweeter, we add some condensed milk. Perfect! Now we add a touch of vanilla flavouring, which is the secret ingredient. <laughs> and lastly, we blend it together so as to achieve a soft and thick texture. There! Now we have to let it cool, because it's ice cream after all. <laughs> so let's put it in the fridge. And we move on to the next step while we leave the ice cream to cool down. Let's grab a few Oreo cookies for Alex. And we crush them so that we can mix them together with the ice cream later on. Here we go! And now we grab some coloured sweets for Lily. And we follow the same process as before. We use the pestle to crush the M&Ms. Great! We're done! Now let's check and see if our ice cream is cold. It's just perfect! Now we have to mix in the selected toppings. <laughs> the selected toppings are the cookie and sweet bits we prepared earlier, Alex. We put the ice cream in the cup. And we add the Oreo cookies. There! Now we have to do the same thing for Lily's McFlurry. First, we add the ice cream. And now the M&M's. Perfect! Let's add a touch of colour. <laughs> so cool! Do you like it, Lily? What is it, Alex? Do you also want sweets? Oh, you want to squirt some syrup on top. There! Do you want to try them? It's a really simple recipe, so we can repeat it any time you like. <laughs> Hi, Lily. Hi, Alex. Do you like jelly as much as I do? And surely you didn't know that you could make it yourself at home. It's very easy. And you can make it with any fruit you want. So start thinking about one. While the babies decide, you can tell us what fruit you'll make your own homemade jelly with in the comments. You want apple? 
Perfect! Mm. Oh, wait! Lily wants strawberries! Mm. Mm. Wait, wait! I think it'll be hard for both of you to agree! What if we use... Mm. The flavor's roulette! <laughs> that way, it's more exciting! <laughs> Which one do you think will come out? <laughs> Orange! This time, Alex won! But you'll see how tasty it is, Lily! <laughs> we need half a liter of juice. If you can squeeze it directly from the oranges, even better! That way, it'll have much more flavor! Mmm, <laughs> so tasty! But don't drink it! Otherwise, we won't have any for dessert! <laughs> Instead, we'll pour it in a mold! Any mold! We can shape the jelly any way we want! Just mix it well with the powder! Let me find them! Here they are! Thank you, Alex! And then, we add a bit to the juice! And stir well, until there are no lumps! Depending on the fruit, you can add sugar, but you don't need to with oranges, they're already very sweet! Now we just have to put it in the fridge and wait for it to cool down! Wow! It was so easy! We finished it so quickly! What if we use... The flavor's roulette! Which one do you think will come out? Strawberry! This time you won, Lily! <laughs> well, we'll repeat the steps. First, we'll put a few strawberries in the blender and turn them into juice so we can mix them with the powder. What's up, Lily? Did you think of something? Strawberry bits? What a good idea! We'll add it to the jelly, and it'll make it tastier! And speaking of flavor, we can add a bit of sugar to the strawberry. What do you think? Everything is ready! Now comes the hardest part, which is waiting for it to cool down! Come on! Let's put the molds in the refrigerator and go play for a while! Who wants to find a treasure? <laughs> the jelly is ready! It looks so good! Wasn't that easy? <laughs> well, come on! Let's eat! <laughs> if you had fun with this video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to our channel! <laughs> and join our great Toon Toon Games family! Yay!